As we go into the B final for the women. Again, this should be a very interesting one. You turn around and you look at the points that were tallied up this morning. There was a couple of 700s and a couple of big 600s. But it could go any way. From Japan will be in lane eight. Lane one, gold medalist in the bounce rope for the para games 100 meters it was that she got that gold medal for the backstroke Carmen Lim 24 year old will go into lane number seven lane two it's the elder Spaniard 39 year old Amanda Cordera Rodriguez will go in lane number two Kalina Basnayake, Asian Para Games, first medal in 13 years for Lady Sri Lanka. Three, Last time out, it really Korea. was an amazing achievement Hai from her. No Hai Won, again another young Korean that's looking Lady to try and make her mark on the scene. The 19-year-old Lily Fox, Fox Mason. Mason. The, another 19 year old, another youngster that's been called to the box. And Kalalova Lubinabonu from Uzbekistan will go in lane number four. She had the fastest time, but it was only 0.9 of a second quicker than Lily Fox Mason. But there is a disparity in classes of an S13 and an S10. So again, this one should be a very, very competitive race. Yeah, yeah, I think we'll be able to see just from the points just how close everyone is. Well, the top points were 716. That was Basnayake. 706 was Lily Fox. And then in third place with 666 was Mibenabono. So it is very close. Just 30 odd points spread and separating those athletes as they get off extremely well and they are looking to push they get the 25 meters and there's very little to choose between the top four or five athletes i think we can see mubin mubin bonu coming all the way in front making a quick lead coming into the wall She's coming away as well, but just on the turn, I think Lily Fox Mason has turned around and just nipped back in front. So that's a nip and tuck there with the S14 and the S13 category swimmers. And coming strong as well, again, is Galina Basniake on this near side. She's going to be very close. It looks as though she might get the touch from where we are at the moment. It looks as though Mason is just dropping off, and it is going to be Basniake that will get the touch first yes it is and she will beat the Korean no it's a great strong swim from Lily Mason question is now is can this be done Miyori Yui on this near side looks as though it's just going to be a little bit too much but it is going to be the Kiwi Lily Fox Mason and who just nipped down Basnayaki to the win. She finishes first. Lily Fox Mason will be the B final winner. Incredible swim by Lily Fox Mason, dropping over almost two seconds of her morning heat time of 109.15. Yeah, 107.21 here. That's uh, that is a pretty good solid two seconds near enough, isn't it? But I tell you what, it was a real strong second 50 from her, wasn't it? She started to come and she just kept going. She swam 35.89 seconds in the second 50 earlier this morning. And that was two seconds slower than the first 50 that she did. So it just shows there that the afternoon athlete comes good again. <laughs> it's, not, it's not just how you start. <laughs> a lot of times, the longer races, you know, 100 meters, 200 meters, it's all about how you come back. You can start off really strong, but if you die off in the second 50, 
then you will not be able to get, achieve what you want to achieve in the end.